and get involved. Good morning. So these two created this book, and they're joining us in studio this morning to talk about this. So this is happening both today and tomorrow. Now, Correct. I see we have some different things here. You guys are going to have vendors that are going to be out there. What are some of these things that we're looking at, and how can they help people? Since it's a, a psychic fair, we have a lot of uh, modalities like psychic readings, but we also have stones there that have healing properties, wellness properties. There's jewelry that have psychic or metaphysical nature, things that can change people's lives and empower them in some way. Now, you're a clairvoyant. I am a master clairvoyant teacher. I'm doing a presentation there. Actually, going to show people how to see life in the other realms here and in heaven. Archangels, ascended masters, something no one else can do, in addition to doing clairvoyant and psychic readings. When did you find out that you had this ability? Well, as a master clairvoyant, I would have been born with it actually in the womb, so you start off that way, right? And you learn that the other world, the rest of the world, doesn't see things the way you do. And so I spent my lifetime actually teaching people how to know that it's real. That's why I'm at this particular fair, trying to convey that there's a reality of these things and showing that we can teach other people to see and experience things that are metaphysical and psychic. Now, we're going to have vendors that are out there at this healing arts fair, but what else is going to be out there besides Dr. Uh, speaking? There is so much going on. I mean, in addition to the readers, there's healers, they have clothing, jewelry, there's massage, there's reggae, there's essential oils. So it's something for all ages. It's twice a year, and it's so popular. Every time we come here, it is full. They have a food truck coming in, and what's really special today is it's uh, honoring or helping out the SPCA. So from 10 to 2, they will be giving away animals for adoption. And okay. so, yeah, and if you go to their website, I think they will give you free entry if you give something on the wish list. So that's something great, too. But there's so much going on. In addition, there's free presentations all day. And of course, Dr. Christian also mentioned his workshop where he teaches you how to see life on the other side right there. So everybody in the audience sees the same thing, as well as other classes where he actually teaches you how to become a medium which is in Burbank. So we come here and we do these events and we're in Christian is actually the only one that goes all across the nation doing readings every weekend. I say he's the only celebrity psychic community that actually reads the public. If people are skeptical about yeah. this, they're watching, they're kind of on the fence, uh -huh. what would you tell them? I would say come to his class today because this one is the most popular one that he does where we actually teach you how to see nature spirits like gnomes, elves, leprechauns, and fairies, crossed over family members, guides, and archangels. And what's great is everybody in the audience sees the same thing, so it's validated. And it's wonderful, so you don't have to be a clairvoyant, especially to see like nature people that we talk about in the book here, um, mystical beings, where nature people are right here on the physical plane with us, so you don't have to be a clairvoyant. It's just seeing something that's a little bit lighter than air, so they're not as physically dense as us, but anybody can do it. It's okay. Great. Okay. <laughs> Anybody could do it, Cody. What do you think? I'm in. I'm in. And I now have new hair gold. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that is, That's uh, just for you guys today. Thank you very much. <laughs> Look good, baby. Love it. Love it. All right. We have to match up. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Play ball.